The Mueller report was produced in this building. Mueller was seen coming to work on Thursday and TV crews staked out positions just outside on Friday, another sign that the Russia investigation was drawing to its long-awaited close. While the contents of the secret report are not yet known, official Washington was already in reaction mode, including President Trump. There was no collusion, there was no obstruction, everybody knows it. It's all a big hoax. It's, I call it the witch hunt. It's all a big hoax. So we'll see what happens. The Mueller report is now in the hands of Attorney General William Barr. Barr will decide how much of the report can be released to Congress and the general public, says Eric Tucker of the Associated Press. But we are not going to know for at least a little bit what the actual content and information and findings of the special counsel are, because that report that the special counsel delivers is done confidentially. Mueller began his investigation in May of 2017 after President Trump fired FBI Director James Comey. Deputy Attorney General Rod Rosenstein appointed Mueller to take over an FBI investigation that had begun during the election campaign in 2016. The investigation into possible collusion between the Trump campaign and Russia led to the indictments of 37 individuals and entities mostly Russian operatives who remain beyond the reach of U.S. law enforcement. Several key former Trump associates were either convicted or pled guilty to criminal charges, including former National Security Advisor Michael Flynn, former Trump campaign manager Paul Manafort, and Trump's former personal lawyer Michael Cohen. The report could clarify questions as to whether the president had any involvement in obstruction of justice or collusion with Russia, says legal expert Paul Schiff Berman. Whether that collusion goes all the way up to Trump himself and can be proven to do so, I think is still an open question. Democratic congressional leaders have ruled out trying to impeach Trump for now, but they are eager to see the details in the Mueller report says Senate Democratic leader Chuck Schumer. Look, I'm going to wait for the Mueller report. We have to see what the Mueller report says, I think, before making any conclusion. No matter the conclusions, the political fallout much, of the Mueller report for Trump the and the country puppet. will be enormous, says Elaine Kamar. It's not often that a president is subject to a special counsel. And that means often that uh, the findings of the special counsel, counsel could lead to something very dramatic, like impeachment, or it could just turn out to be a bunch of nothing. Submission of the report signifies the end of the Russia probe led by Mueller. Now the wait begins for the release of its conclusions and the political storm that could follow. Jim Malone, VOA News, Washington.